New tonight, a local congressman tasked with replacing Obamacare says it will be at least 2019 before that happens. Richard Hudson met with health care workers in our area today, and Eyewitness News anchor Blaine Tallison questioned him about what this means for patients. The fight over repealing Obamacare has been a deeply partisan one, but today here in Salisbury, Republican U.S. Representative Richard Hudson told me he hopes replacing it can be a bipartisan effort. <laughs> Congressman Richard Hudson visited Novant Health's Rowan Medical Center. It's one of four stops Hudson is making this week at North Carolina hospitals to speak with administrators about rolling out a replacement to Obamacare. We're going to put patients in charge of their health care. We're going to take the bureaucrats out of the way, and we're going to create a system that works for everybody. GOP members in both the House and Senate used their majority last week approve a budget resolution that paved the way to eventually repeal the Affordable Care Act. It's been a bitter fight between Republicans and Democrats. What would you say to people who think that this may be more about politics than health care? This is about people. It's not about politics. With Obamacare up in the air, Governor Roy Cooper says he's doing everything he can by expanding Medicaid to get more North Carolinians coverage. And I want to get North Carolina into the best position that we can possibly be in as we approach this uh, Trump era of health care reform, whatever that is going to be. Today, Congressman Hudson may be easing some concerns that Republicans are acting too hasty. Representative Hudson told me that he plans to take his findings from area hospitals back to Washington with him to a committee to help shape the replacement for Obamacare. In Rowan County, Blaine Tollison, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.